I already did an optimization for The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt a while ago and it's available in Lost Peaks Experience since its launch, but not in this fashion. Before I even start with the video and before people start commenting wow your software is full of ads only for money and not actually helping me, ok ok I'll just post this side by side comparison on the screen now, no difference. Ok, maybe no difference in terms of quality yet, but in terms of performance, there is. 15 to 20 frames per second more on my main gaming rig with G4 GTX 970 and Core i5 at 1080p. Ok, now I'll show you this. Now do you see the difference here? Of course you do now, this is the ultra low specs optimization, this is almost same as the very first with the Witcher game, FPS improvement, around 30 to 50 frames per second on the G4 GTX 970. I'll just say enough of making excuses about the software that actually works, just because you can't skip the ad on the ad fly link. The problem is that you're not reading these messages here, that's the problem. Anyway, I'm Ragus, your host, and welcome to yet another Low Specs Experience optimization video. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to optimize and improve performance in The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt on your low end, mid end, or high end PC, whatever it is, doesn't matter. Low Specs Experience will improve the performance for you. It was a long time ago, that I, like way back in 2013, that I was doing only Low Specs patches for low end PCs and stuff like that. Low Specs Experience is designed for everyone. First of all, what you need to do is to download Low Specs Experience from my website and install it. After you install it, uh, start it from your desktop shortcut. This screen will pop up and now press optimize down here. Now from this drop down menu select the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. This control center will pop up and now simply select the method of optimization do you want. I'll show you the way on how it's done on the stock low specs optimization. The process is the same even for the ultra low specs optimizations. So after you select which method of optimization do you want, simply select the resolution you want to run your game on and then press optimize. That's all you need to do. Now start your game. Right before we jump into the game, I'll just show you two additional things that may come in handy, and these being how to restore default settings. Okay, so just simply go to Lowspeak Experience and press Restore Default. It's as simple as it gets. If you run into any problems while using Lowspeak Experience, make sure to contact us through the contact tab, and we'll gladly answer all of your questions, usually under 24 hours. Now let's see if the optimization actually helped. Well, we already know that it did help, but as every optimization video recently on my channel, I'm showing the before and after optimization gameplay. FPS improvement will be shown somewhere on screen that I'll add while editing the video. Anyway, I'm leaving you now with more The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt gameplay. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you found this useful. And remember, low specs experience doesn't work. <laughs> it's all just for the money. Ragnar's out, bye bye. Ever tell you about this sorcerer I knew? Couldn't stop talking about how useful they are as creatures. Because you can brew potions from their blood? <laughs> no, because by eating rotting corpses they prevent epidemics. Hmm. Did he know they eat the living as well? No. Really upset him too. His theory collapsed. War is not exactly going our way. We have a side. The Northern Realms. Radovid's realms, don't you mean? Temeria and Edern are no more. Radovid's pledged to restore the old borders as soon as he wins the war. Believe that? <laughs> Gotta believe something. It's what keeps us going. 